You are the crankiest engaged couple that I've ever seen. You have come and I've had some cranky engaged people in here. You seem very mad at each other. And you seem to be, uh, you don't even like nothing about the brother. And you know he smells bad. He don't even work and you know. And after all of that, after all of that contention, after all of that negativity, you both seem to indicate that you have a love that is so deep and so fulfilling that you can't stay away from one another. And let me suggest this. Marriage is a long haul and really, really is. And whatever you don't even like about the other person or whether you don't have to be comfortable with it you have to be comfortable with it and you have to be able to you know you already named it because you have to be content with it because typically things do not get any better than they do right now so and if there are things that he does that you don't even like or you have to learn how to be content with it and not barking at him about it all the time because that kind of marriage doesn't work it out it's an ongoing battle secondly Yes, he did cheat on you in a foul, tacky, wretched kind of a way he did. But you had to make a decision, Miss Pearson. Either you're going to keep him and trust him or live a miserable life with him or lose him. Because if you got him and go ahead, trust him. Don't make him to take a picture of the job. Don't expect him home other this and that and the other. Because you're going to make it every day miserable of the off chance that, that one day that he's going to do something that he did for 10 years ago. Why that kind of life? You understand what I'm saying to you, Mr. Langston? I don't know what to tell you. But except at all, and if you love her and you can't stay with her, um, marry her. Keep her in the house and with your stay calm and brush your teeth. This matter is adjourned. My favorite piece of model advice is the one we gave to Terry and Danny. And it's this, you got to be able to name it at least five things that you don't like about your significant other. Then ask yourself, are you willing to live with it long term? If you would like to your case to be heard on Divorce Court, call us toll free at 1-877-311-2222 or visit at divorcecourt.com.